Episode five, food fight. We are eating subs today. So, Jersey Mike, Limpies. Limpies, Subway. As we always do, we have to do our predictions, Rishi. What is your history on Jersey Mike's? Jersey Mike's I had about 10 years ago, but here's the thing. If Wait, go for real? Like, actually? 2011. To the You're asking me if I had Jersey Mike's in the last time when I'm actually a spokesperson for Subway. Hey, sorry, this would have been an unboxing video, but <laughs> I just couldn't wait. Fresh mozzarella, balsamic sub sauce, woo! Sorry, y'all, I need a minute. I love you, baby. That's how true. in the world can I eat Jersey Mike's when I gotta pay to eat Subway? That's how committed I am to you, Subway. All right, here's the how thing. At the end of the day, this is why I look at this. They're all deli meats, they're all chains, right? Yeah. I don't think any of them are gonna be vastly different now. So for me, I'm speaking for me, Subway number one, Jersey Mike's number two, Blimpy's number three, but I think Jersey Mike's is probably a better sandwich. When was the last time you had Blimpy's? Never. Never in my life had I had Blimpy's. I could just see from the sandwich, it's going to be my number three. That's I've never really, tasted it. That's really crazy that you've never had Blimpy's. I've never had Blimpy's. I've always passed by Blimpy's, never had one, never ate one. I, I think... Jersey Mike's is gonna be number one just because they're more expensive. Do you think Actually, the price of this makes you think that they're, everything else is fresher than the other two? It has to justify the price. Like, this was five something and this was like eight something. Do you think a Nike, like a, a like Nike a shoe versus Adidas shoe is that much better and different? Could use more premium uh, material, for sure. I mean, sure, but as far as taste go, I think they probably use low base ingredients. Just like, say, it's definitely these, not gonna... these idiots out here, we're gonna make it look like it's fresher. It's the best of the worst, <laughs> is what I'm trying to say. Okay? Like, like, we're from New York and New Jersey, yeah. and we have like really good delis around. Any of these three obviously do not compare to those. Here's the difference between a deli and Subway and all these three. We had to go through a Walmart to get Subway. Out of this type of base, a 4.5. You're already predicting the score now. I'm already predicting scores of each of these. 4.5 okay. or 3.5. Okay. I think Jersey Mike's is going to be best because of the price. More familiar with Subway. Haven't had Blippies in a very long time, but I'm going to go Subway just because I've been loyal to them for a while. They got me through college. The five dollar foot longs. Nostalgia, right? Five dollar. Five dollar foot longs got me through college. The bacon chicken ranch. Yes. And the sweet onion chicken teriyaki. Blimpies I had sometimes in high school, but... You've had Blimpies? They remind Here me of the drug rats of sandwiches. Honestly, like, I remember the quality kind of being similar, but now we get to actually try one after the other. Do this. <laughs> so, from all three places, we got an Italian sandwich. There is Jersey Mike's Italian sandwich. You want to tell them what's in it? Each of the three chains, we got very similar sandwiches. We got whatever had the name Italian in it. Yeah, That's whatever what they chose. believe Italian meant. Yeah. I, I like the bread. The bread is already fluffy. I'm surprised. Oh, this is good. It's actually very good. I am very surprised. I told you, man. It's got to justify the price. I really think... You gotta justify the price. And I'll be honest, but this is gonna be very similar to the hot dog challenge. But this is actually pretty good. This is pretty good. good. Dude, the bread is like amazing. It's, it's soft. Very, it's very soft. It's crazy soft. It has flavor. They have to, what do they put on top? The oil and vinegar comes through. The All the vegetables. The, are, all the veggies say it's fresh. Vegeta yeah, vegetables actually look decently fresh. I would say the quality of some of the meat, I think their seasoning is better than their meat. I think their meat is like still kind of low quality meat, but the bread and the seasoning is very good on this. To be honest, the deli, even their meats are okay. They're good. It, it It's fine. I think the whole sandwich is a 4.5 to be honest. This is truly my 4.5. It's definitely good. I'll give it a 4. Out of these, what chain do you think is going to beat Jersey Mike's? I don't think any of them are going to be Jersey Mike's. That's why it's a 4.5. None of them could be fives. Because we can't I compare it to delis. Why not? You can compare it to delis. I mean... I think there I, there are delis that taste worse than this. There's plenty of places that taste yeah. worse than this. So this you can consistently use, good. So you throw Jersey Mike's into the pool of delis. He, it beats some of the crappy delis. It beats 90% of delis, but there's 10% it's not going to beat. 
or your local delis where they take care but, of the food, and those will compare. We can't compare these. This this score is just an overall score of how I feel about the sandwich. I think it's a four out of five. <laughs> All right, you know what? We'll call it a 4.25 out of 5. Let's <laughs> just meet there. <laughs> All right, let's just move on to Subway. All right. This is how... They didn't cut this in half. You got a knife? Yes. I like how we're doing it together. <laughs> All right. So this is your Subway sandwich. Bread. It's okay. Get up in it's there. It's not soft. It's not crunchy. It's not anything. Significantly this smaller. Significantly smaller. Okay, look at, look at the quality of the cuts. This quality versus this quality. Subway looks like garbage. Um, everything about Subway looks sad to me. Now granted, we didn't get Jersey Mike's bread toasted because it probably wind up the same, so I'm not gonna hold Subway on the bread because your bread's usually solid. But, you taking a bite already? Let's do it. Mmm. Mm. Bread's not that great, but it's not that bad. Bread's not good. All right, stop hating. It's pretty hard. It's very hard and got toasted. That's why I gave it a discount. All right. It's All terrible right. for toasting. All right, yeah. but it gets a it gets a small discount, but I like the uh, they put like spicy meat in there, which has a little kick. I like that, but other than that, I'd say quality definitely lower than Jersey Mike's. Everything about it, from the bread to the meat to the veggies, it just doesn't have the same. Uh, I'm not gonna lie to you. Same oomph. You just insulted my childhood just now through and through. I'm gonna take offense to that. Because to me, this is a, it's not as good as Jersey Mike's. This is that straight. But it's not bad. I'm gonna go with that. This sandwich right here, if it was in a club, I'd probably sleep with it. I'll try it. It's, it's a chubby girl. We, no one wants it, I want it. I enjoy this very much. And I don't know if it's because my dad took me almost every weekend or every Indian owns a subway, but I am a fan. It's a four. It's not a 4.5 though. It's a lot wrong with it. I'm gonna go easier on it because, not just because of your beautiful speech, <laughs> your, your, your confession to, to Subway and your loyalty to Subway. <laughs> it's not bad by any means. Having the bite from Jersey Mike's to this is drastically different though. So if I just had this without having the other sandwich, it, it would be fine. Oh, my, be. Well, my score, um, Subway, I don't wanna be, I don't wanna be too mean. Give it, I'll give it a, a, a 2.5. That wasn't too mean. <laughs> All right, we're about to try Blimpies. This okay. sandwich, this bread I'm already- It's soggy. It looks sad. This, it feels like it's just filled with water. It feels wet. This sandwich- It is wet. This sandwich looks corporate. It this looks, is a corporate sandwich. It's like so nicely- Built. Built and cut and neat and has zero soul to it. You ready for a bite? I'm not really, but hold on. Ready? Three, two, one. Not gonna lie to you. This tastes like my high school sandwich. I actually like it. It's better than I thought it would be. It is way better than I thought it would be. I think that's because we grew up in suburb, suburban neighborhoods. I don't think I like mayo this much. I like mayo this much. I like it dripping all over my sandwich. Why is this soggy bread good? <laughs> <laughs> Why is it good? I give up. I don't understand. It is soggy, but good. All right, I'm gonna tell you this. This is the whitest thing I've ever eaten in my life. Is that an appropriate thing to say? Am I being insensitive? This is the most Caucasian thing I've ever eaten. This is, nothing about this tastes cultured. And for me, it was actually pretty decent. But, if I would give it a score, because of how wet and how like you could barely taste anything else but mayo and their oil and vinegar. But I did like the sandwich, I'm gonna give it a two. A <laughs> two? <laughs> it tastes like a well-made home sandwich you would make. From like, the supermarket deli meat. Yeah, it's like a suburban mom, yeah. no class, from like- I think this tastes better than Subway. No. I know you're a spokesperson for them, so no. you can't say that. I owe you. I owe you. I am comfortably giving Blimpies a three. Wow. Yes. I think it, I think it's better than Subway. <laughs> the I way you say Subway sounds like you have hatred towards them. They do something. You <laughs> Subway beat me up in college. <laughs> Honestly, like I do feel like 
the price points are justified at each store. I think Subway uses the lowest quality meat and, and stuff. Blimpies at $7, pretty good, decent. Jersey Mike's, it was like over $8, I think. If you want a pretty decent sandwich, yeah, go with Jersey Mike's. I liked it a lot, but. I didn't want to look in the camera, but I agree with that sentiment. I just was staring at all the sandwiches because I'm still very hungry. It, this was actually a very interesting day because before we ate these, I would have thought that they would be more similar to each other, but they're actually all very different. Very different. Like, I, especially Subway and- Blimpies. Blimpies, I thought they would be very similar, but they have their own distinctive styles. Yeah, I thought this would be a hot dog thing. It wasn't, but thank you guys so much for tuning in to episode five. John Kim. Peace, have a good one. Make sure to like and subscribe as always. <laughs> this is we are never- <laughs> No, 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 we got it sober, 100%. <laughs> we are never doing this ever again. Uh